So hey guys, same orders there. Welcome back to the new video. So in today's video, we are going to show you how to install this graphics board into a Lumen PC. Well, the gameplay you are seeing right now is 100% real and it's not fake. Okay, so do you want to know how can we use and how can we install this graphics board into a Lumen PC? And main thing, what will be the system requirements in order to play this mod? Well, do you want to know everything about this mod? Please watch this video till end. Please don't skip any part of this video, you know, because you skip any part of this video then your game won't look like mine, you know, because the installation is little bit tricky compared to my other videos. So please don't skip any part of this video. Now let's talk about the requirements in order to play this mod. You need just 2GB of RAM, any dual core processor and a 512 MP graphics card, you know. If you don't have graphics card, then don't need to worry about it. If you have Intel SD graphics, then you can still enjoy this mod. Okay, enough talking about this mod. So without any further ado, let's get started to the video guys. But wait, before getting started, make sure to drop a like on this video, save this video to all your friends and if you're new, then what are you doing? Make sure to subscribe to this channel and ring the bell icon so you my friend never miss any of my future upload. So without any further ado, let's get started to the video guys. Okay, so my buddy, as you can see, we are in our desktop screen and first thing, you need to download these two files from the given link in the description. Okay, once you downloaded all the files, make sure to extract your optional file into your desktop or any specific folder you want to extract. Now from here, what you need to do is open your game directory, my friend. Once you have opened your game directory, open your optional file and search for your Sleo ASI Loader plus Mod Loader. Now from here what you need to do is just drag and drop all this file into your game directory and hit on replace if it asks. You know, now search for your graphics fix. Now this will fix your text and missing problem from your game, you know, from there. So in order to install this, make sure to drag and drop all this file into your game directory my friend. Okay, so minimize both of this window. Now from here what you need to do is extract your reset by Abhina Motors, you know, the folder you downloaded right now, the file you downloaded right now. Okay, now once the file get extracted, open your extracted file into your desktop or any specific folder you want to extract. Now from here what you need to do is open your requirements and if you haven't installed a DirectX in your PC, then please make sure to install this. Okay. If you don't install your DirectX, then your game don't, won't start. Now from here, what you need to do is open your copy to your game folder and then just drag and drop all this file into your game directory, my friend. Now once you did all these steps, go to your My Preset and it is very important, you know. Now if you have followed my GTA 5 Redux mod for low-end PC, then the installation is pretty simple like that, you know. But if you are new and if you are completely beginner in a reset, you know, so you have to watch my video till end. So my friend, now you have to run env.exe, you know, I have already provided env.exe in my optional 2.0 folder. Okay, now just drag and drop env.exe into your game directory and always run env.exe. If you don't do this step, then your game will crash, you know. Now the most difficult part of this video will begin from here, you know. Now just wait and watch, you know. Please don't skip any part of this video. I am already continuously reminding you, you know. Now press delete from your keyboard. And then from here what you need to do is, uh, effects are disabled, please uh, press scroll lock to enable your effect again, you know. Press uh, scroll lock. Then from here what you need to do is press any letter, you know. Then instead of C, enter your drive letter that you have just installed your game, you know. Now hit enter. Now from here what you need to do is go, uh, click on these two dots and then from here go to your installed game directory. For, in my case my game has been installed on games, GTA San Andreas and then from here select abinopreset.ini and then you're all good to go. Now just run your game. Now please, again I am reminding, please don't skip this video, you know.
Okay, so in this case, your game may be unresponsible for some times. You know, the game looks too abysmal, but uh, the effects are not applied. You know, so from here, what you need to do is make sure to press delete again, and then as you can see the effects are disabled. Now, from here, you need to press scroll lock button. Now, when you press the scroll lock button, and then you can see our effect has been successfully applied to your game. So, my friend. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching till end. I appreciate your patience. You watched my video till end. So thank you so much for watching again. Okay. So as always, I'll see you into my next one. Till then, goodbye. But wait, before saying goodbye, make sure to drop a like on this video if you appreciate my hard work. You know, in order to make one video, there's a lot of effort. So if you appreciate it, make sure to drop a like on this video. Share this video to all your friends. And if you're new, then what you're doing? Make sure to subscribe to this channel. So. Uh, I'll see you in my next one. Till then, goodbye, man.